I want to be clear that I'm not trying to breed superworms. I'm just trying to keep them alive so that I can feed them off to my chameleons. So we're going to need a few things. You're going to need a container that's ventilated. This is just a was it, 15 quart tote and the top has been cut off. I'll show you guys. Been cut out and then this mesh uh, window screen has been taped on there and there's just clear plastic. Superworms can't climb this so it's good and we want the ventilation. I've got some spare egg cartons although there's a few in here already. We've got wheat bran, we've got plain oats, and we've got some gut load for our buggies. So let's open up this box here. Knife. Okay, let's see what the damage is. Superworms kind of freak me out, so we'll see how this goes. I've also never dealt with this many superworms at once. Oh, wow, okay, there's a lot in there. I also don't want to touch them. Oh, there's so many, so many. I don't know, can you guys see that? Oh, yeah, okay. So though, there's the, we're just gonna set these over here. Yeah, okay. So I don't know if I'll have enough substrate, but we're going to try. So we've got some leftover wheat bran that I had. Yep, okay. We're making great progress. <laughs> and I have some oats that I had hanging around. These are plain oats, just old-fashioned oats, nothing fancy, and some wheat bran. I might go pick up some more from the store, to be honest, but this will be good for now. But you can pick up wheat bran from the grocery store as well, so then we'll throw in some plain oats. Mix this up here. Mmm, yummy! So wheat bran and plain oats are good. I'd probably give a bit more of a thicker layer, but that's fine. And we'll toss in some egg carts. And now we gotta deal with 500 Superworms. This is gonna be disgusting. Oh man, this. I'm not touching these guys. So don't make fun of me, but I don't touch any of my bugs with my hands. Especially superworms. They can. I've heard they can bite you. I'm not trying to get bit. Okay, we're just gonna go for it. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Can you see that? That's disgusting. All right. Well, that was. Fairly straightforward. Okay, nothing on there. All right, layer number two. Oh, they're falling. Gross, gross, gross. Okay, okay, okay. That doesn't quite fit. Get off. Oh gosh, just like something out of a nightmare. Everybody out. Off. But I wanted to not have to deal with buying bugs all the time, you know? Especially, I underestimated how much three chameleons will eat, not to mention two juveniles and an adult chameleon. Plus, Neptune's a sucker for superworms. So, hopefully, these will last me. A while. Okay, we've got one more layer of egg carton here. Oh, oh! They went flying! Okay, okay. One here. One definitely went in my sink. Oh, gross. Okay, got it. Well, that was fun. Both for me and I'm sure the superworm that went flying. Okay. This looks good. Okay, and then we've got a few stragglers in this box. I'll show you guys. Oh, gross. Okay. If you're not okay with dealing with 
life bugs. You shouldn't get a chameleon. Because they only eat live bugs. And like this was one thing that I was, when I was deciding whether or not to get my chameleons, the, my two hesitations, my two reservations with it were committing to the lifespan of a chameleon, which isn't as long as other reptiles, but like it's still a good chunk of time, you know, probably at least five years for Neptune, maybe seven years, who knows, all to be determined. But either way, I was like, if I'm going to get one, I'm in it for the long haul, right? So I was more to make sure I was committed for the whole lifespan of the animal and live bugs. Gross. I was like, I have to be okay with dealing with live bugs. And I've gotten better, but it still grosses me out. Can you guys hear the feet, like them crawling around? Okay, here we go. One more little guy. Any other stragglers? Nasty. Okay. Oh, here's another one. Oh. Oh, there's more. Oh. Oh wow. Definitely more. Okay. See this little tail sticking out? Nasty. 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 Okay. Props to any of you who ah, they're on my counter. Props to any of you who can deal with super worms and grab them with your hands. Anyone else? Trying to come out? Alright. And for peace of mind, I'm going to put this box outside for a day or two to make sure if there are any stragglers that they climb outside and not in my apartment. But I feel fairly confident. <clears throat> that I got them all. Okay. So yeah, I feel like that's a pretty decent setup. They'll eventually go into the, the substrate that I put in the... Ah! No straggler. I swear. I'm going to find these in my sleep. Okay. So I used wheat bran and old-fashioned oats. We've got some egg carton in there. Um, I might toss these guys in there. I don't know. So all that we need to do left is add some gut load. So today I'm going to throw in some sweet potato. I did a whole video on gut loading, so feel free to check that out. I will link it up above here. Feel free. I'm just going to chop up some sweet potato for these guys. And we will also do some mango. Oh, that's a hair. For them. So make sure you're changing out gut load. The, the wheat bran and old fashioned oats isn't sufficient just to gut load. You want to also provide fruits and vegetables. You don't need to add in any like water crystals or anything like that because they're getting the moisture from the gut load. So in this case, we've got sweet potato and mango. You can um, throw in a bunch of other things. Just make sure that it's gut load that is safe for your chameleon. A little bit more mango in here because there's a bajillion of these guys. And voila, we have now housed 500 super worms. Wow, there's so many. I think the most I've ordered at once is 150. So this is a lot, but that's the point, right? So as the final product. Ooh, ah. If you thought this video was super, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Leave any questions or comments down below. Feel free to subscribe so you know when I post a new video. You can follow Neptune and all my chameleons on Instagram at Neptune the Chameleon. Thank you so much for watching and have a good day. Bye! I came in like a